Oh, the fly got him. Oh, he hit it. Oh, he chased it out. He hit it and he chased it out. Oh, oh, he hit it again. Bloody hell. They're hitting it. They're wanting it. But they are so scared. I've certainly found the lure that they want. I'm convinced of that. But they are so chicken. You follow, look. That's a blackfish. That was a really big blackfish fired that out there then. I don't know if you'll come back and hit it. The first time was a trout, but that was definitely a blackfish. There he is, he's right there. Big blackfish. The big blackfish followed it out, that's really cool. That's not something you see all that often. I have actually caught a blackfish on a soft plastic once. Got him! What did I get? The blackfish! <laughs> look at the size of me blackfish! I can't even wet my hand a bit and look after him, he's a bloody lovely little fish. There we go folks, have a look at that for a blackfish. As far as uh, the northern side of the Great Dividing Range goes, that is an absolute ripper. Two spined blackfish. I'm going to get a quick photo of him. I'll put him back in there. If he gets off, he gets off. That's good and well. But he's definitely well worth a photo. That has really made my day. There you go, folks. Have a look at that for a beautiful freshwater blackfish. Look at that folks, that is a magnificent freshwater blackfish. Look at the beautiful colours on him. Beautiful blackfish. See you later mate. I had a big trout follow it out and he wouldn't take it. I've had quite a lot of trout follow it out and not take it. But the blackfish came out and took it. That has made my day. Blackfish on the southern side of the Great Dividing Range get much, much bigger. But that one there, this side of the Great Dividing Range, on the northern side of the Great Dividing Range, that's actually a quite a large blackfish. And I've got quite a large smile on my face. You ripper!